All 64 SUNY campuses across New York State plan to fully reopen with in-person classes this fall. Chancellor Jim Malatris tells News Channel 34 that vaccination rates for SUNY students are outpacing the general state population. So schools like Binghamton University and SUNY Broome will return to the classroom with no capacity limits. The only restrictions will be for those who remain unvaccinated. They will be required to continue masking and social distancing as well as be subject to weekly COVID testing. They may also be barred from sports and special events if unvaccinated. Malatra says BU and SUNY Broome have done quite well with student vaccination rates. I think Binghamton University, as a couple of weeks ago, is like 80% of their students have been vaccinated. In Broome, it's like 77% of their students have been vaccinated, so that's good. We're finding some issues on the faculty and staff side, actually. Um, for instance, at Broome Community College, I believe, I believe only 40% of their faculty and staff have been vaccinated so far. So part of what we're doing is not just focusing on our students. We want everybody to be vaccinated because we want to make sure everybody is able to enjoy the college experience. A SUNY Broome official tells News Channel 34 that the 40% number is derived from a voluntary survey taken over a month ago and that the school expects vaccination rates for faculty and staff to be much higher come the start of the semester. The SUNY system has launched a 30-day vax challenge using social media messages, many by fellow students, to encourage the unvaccinated to get their shot. You can catch my entire Zoom interview with the Chancellor at BinghamtonHomepage.com.